Hello, hello. I am back. <laughs> Hope you're still here. <laughs> Happy to see you. <clears throat> so, I managed to have that lovely piece of cake. I hope you enjoyed a little bit of music. It's just uh, the usual the usual break playlist. <laughs> Weird old man, hello. Ah, thanks, Ellie. Thank you. Welcome back yourselves. <laughs> so that's just a little bit of a playlist that I put together for our breaks. It's rather quick. I hope you like it. <laughs> I think I'm going to be using it. It's not on shuffle. It's always the same because it's a nice mix. <laughs> F your cake, son. <laughs> F for the cake. <laughs> well, it was delicious. <laughs> Don't get me wrong. It really is. There are only two pieces left. And uh, my girlfriend took quite a bit of it uh, to work yesterday. And everybody was like, you can bring it more often. <laughs> Because, <laughs> yeah, I guess most of you already know she really can cook. <laughs> and she's great. And I love her. So. <laughs> and she's at work right now. And actually, it is raining outside. That's uh, it's not too great. <clears throat> and the guys are actually trying to cover that broken roof in that block next to us. <laughs> Firebomb, just kidding. Obviously, I hope it's super delicious. It was. It was. It's not overly sweet. It's good. Glad to hear. Ellie, can I have a piece of the cake? You could. <laughs> Two pieces left. Should I fax it or just zip it and via email? <laughs> All that good stuff. Bam. I'm going to pause the music right there. I believe I have... Uh, decreased the music here so i'm just gonna put it back up to a certain degree <clears throat> so that we can continue there we go the sounds of the sea and uh firebomb so i guess i'm wondering why coke is used as opposed to food coloring i don't know i somebody just devised that that recipe and the first time we tasted it was uh, my mom brought it. When my parents were visiting, I believe my, my mom brought it along and she then sent the recipe to my girlfriend. Maybe it's a little bit of taste uh, or a little bit of uh, texture that the flower should take out, out, with, uh, out of the coke. But I don't think like uh, when it's finished, you don't really feel it. There's no no taste of coke. It's mostly taste of chocolate and banana. <laughs> and Ellie, post a picture on Discord. Well, <laughs> I didn't make one. So I can maybe... I'm not really used to posting food. I posted a few food pictures on Discord from vacation. <laughs> that was an exception. But maybe I can. I can put it on a plate and uh, take a nice picture for all of you to see on Discord if you would like <laughs> but please don't force me to to translate the recipe <laughs> that would be difficult <laughs> quite a bit firebomb so because of that one movie i always think of ellie as extinction level event <laughs> okay deep impact oh deep impact was the movie let's see some goddamn pie now <laughs> no no not right now we will be wasting some time. I will waste your time later. <laughs> Let's waste your time on stream and Discord comes later. <laughs> but of course, anyone who, who wishes to join the Discord, please do so. It's, uh, it's a little quiet, but it's fun <laughs> most of the time. And if I actually need to post something uh, of importance, like when I will not be able to stream because of me feeling unwell I will put that on discord of course you can follow my Twitter as well please the numbers are low <laughs> but the most important thing as I always say is to have you here on stream on twitch this is the most important place to be the other 
options are just complementary to that, as as usual. As is the streamer tradition. Okay, we scavenged everything. And what did I miss? <laughs> Weird old man, so I have to admit I was surprised when the notification for my second month sub popped up. I hadn't realized it had been a month already. Right? It doesn't feel like it. It really doesn't feel like it. Was it really a month? <laughs> I don't know if I can really check it. Maybe, maybe I would be able to find the first one in my in my events list. But I hope it's accurate. I hope Twitch is not really pulling money out of your pocket unintentionally. <laughs> it has it has been a month already, and my computer still hasn't arrived. Ah, damn it. I think you will choose another company uh, from now on <laughs> to build your computer. And Belden, I think that you can just put recipe there in original language. We can deal with it. <laughs> Belden could deal with it. Maybe Google will translate it for you. And Ellie, I see on your Discord you played The Long Dark. Yes. <laughs> it was intense. <laughs> And but we finished the the what was the name winter well the story mode the name escaped my mind right now but we played through the story modes and we finished up uh, at the last you know the last bit that we could and maybe we will return <laughs> when other chapters are actually released but they're taking their sweet time with it <laughs> Farbum, you can send the recipe and we will translate it later. <laughs> Ellie, do not remind me. Oh, <laughs> yeah, so Farbum was not really happy about the long dark. <laughs> it was long and it was dark. And Ellie, I got into the game quite a bit. Haven't played in over a month though, more like two months. It's not a bad game. But I believe the thing that was not really liked is the needed micromanagement that you need to do for, you know, survival. But it, it is one of the harsh and more realistic survivals. More realistic, well, uh, in brackets, uh, in, in quotations as well. But it's harsh. It's definitely harsh. You can check on the subscription page, indeed. Winter Mute. Okay, thank you, Ellie. Wintermute was the word. I think the next chapter is out on October the 22nd. Have they really announced it? The last time I read uh, something from the devs was that they will only announce it when they feel like they are getting into real completion and they will not like force anything. So that's nice. I guess quite a bit of time has passed since we played it. And Ellie, yeah, definitely one of the harder survival games on the Steam page. Okay, all right, so they actually announced it then. 22nd October. Hmm. I have to keep that in mind, but I will try to put it in the queue and we can maybe go through it. I really hope that we played it after I had to replace my, my OS uh, SSD because we had a little break <laughs> in the stream because my original SSD with my Windows 7 on it broke and I had to replace it and then I decided to go for Win 10. So I don't know if I have the saves or I actually hope that if we played it before that occurred that it has cloud saves on Steam. Let us hope, let us pray. Because in... <laughs> No way I'm going through all the chapters. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. Belvin, by the way, what happened in Flotsam World that everything is flooded? I don't think they released that, so... Hmm... They released a roadmap. So I'm... I'm gonna check real quick. If they mentioned something about uh, 
like a campaign or a, or a story. Early, it's an early access roadmap. And I believe I retweeted that. Anyway, so first bit is community feedback. So they're getting a lot of it right now. Then they will work on day and night cycle, which is, um, I don't know, not too great, but it's day and night and a schedule and daily reports, better sleep and more. This is under day and night. And then simple weather, weather system, weather effects, weather buildings and more. And goals, player goals, ecological town and more. And then to be decided. So it has not really been specified what has happened. But I believe it might be a general flood due to maybe ice caps melting and people not really paying attention to the environment. I would assume this is the thing. And let's get back. Where is my OBS? There we go. Ice caps melting was what I thought too. Yeah, that, that would be the most obvious reason. Because it's not like a lot of water will just appear. I believe it might be an, an overall ecological ecological catastrophe. Catastrophe. Maybe cats are involved. All right. Um, I mentioned that we will not take water, right? <laughs> really hope that they might finish it when we move through the map, but it's not really happening, sadly. This one, this water container, the bugged one. Firebomb, well now I'm sad. Be right back. Why? What happened? Hmm. Well, I hope Firebomb will tell us what happened once he's back. Okay. How many... We have just one fishing boy. How many more fishing poles are there? This is one. That's great. There is another one yet again in the fog, so mm, nope, nopety nope. Nothing else over here. Okay, there is another one. Really? Ah, damn it. Okay. It's out of the question. And there is another one. I really think those will be all. No, there is another one. I'm gonna mark all of them and they can slowly work towards this. Or there is another option. We can... We can get more mooring points. Look, I'm gonna expand on this. We're gonna... We're gonna... Ooh, we cannot. Oh, damn. This limitation, though, I really would like to see this uh, getting increased. Like, maybe you will need to upgrade the center of the city to have a wider range of uh, potential building. That could, be be that could be much, much better. So. I guess we're only building the, the mooring points, then. So we couldn't... I wanted to place another water still here. But for some unknown reason, it is red. Even though it could be built somewhere in here, it doesn't really have the space for it right now. But we had another spot where we could build it. Anyway, since we cannot, we can have another mooring point in here. 
and we will be able to build like two more fishing boats which will make fishing much faster doop 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 bang <laughs> i also crafted uh, another hefty cup of tea for me for today and this afternoon i chose the same so i have uh english breakfast black tea tesco finest I guess, or I don't know. No, it's not Tesco Finest. This one is something else. <laughs> I forgot what it was, though. Do, 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 do. We should get some more Earl Grey. Bum, 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 ba -dum, bum. Okay, another mooring point, which means we can have a fishing boat right here. And what else can we get? Are we using a lot of uh, firewood? We are! So I can put this one into production and I can maybe ask for more firewood. So Firebomb, hey, have I ever sent an accidental message when I fall asleep? I usually have my phone uh, by my head, so I don't think so. Maybe once I, I noticed something, but that was just like maybe a few letters. So it didn't make any sense. But uh, why did you write, uh, well, now I'm sad? You just wrote that before you went be right back. So uh, did something happen? Is everything okay? Okie dokie. What about plastic? There is some. Can also take some plastic. And we're Romans, so probably because of the ice caps thing. Yeah, probably. If we are still referring to the to the reasons, right, of uh, the whole world being flooded. Ice caps, indeed. <clears throat> okay. After this one, we are resetting the map. It's okay. That's fine. What about research? We have 11 research points. So... Ah. Maybe we can unlock this one. Because I guess uh, the next time we get to a point where we can have some research points, it will give us 10 at least. So that would leave us with 16. Okie dokie. What does a small water container need? Small water container. Hmm, are you serious? It needs six pipes. Both the small and the large need six pipes. Uh, that's that's not adequate. I don't think that's very adequate. It should be much cheaper. Of course, here you still need to provide metal scrap, but pipes pipes are two metal scrap each, so that's a lot of metal scrap just for even the small one. Oh, so ice caps were you saying you were sad? Oh. <laughs> well, it might very well happen. Let's see. <clears throat> so that will probably be for the for the next generation to sort out. They're trying to start fighting against uh, all this climate change and all that good stuff. So I still don't know if I ever will <laughs> have any kids, so I don't know if it will be for my kids to to worry about. <laughs> and that's that. Ooh. Okay, my corgi protector is now in front of my table. 
good thing because I wanted to, to move my chair a little and I was worried that I will injure his paws, Mr. Dumbledore. I'm gonna save this. Great. And Farbam, we're gonna be dead soon, so yeah, I feel bad for these kids. <laughs> I thought you mean that you're gonna fall asleep. <laughs> not that you're gonna be dead soon. You're not gonna be dead soon. <laughs> you're gonna be dead late. Right? <laughs> Albus. Albus alarm. Good. Okay, we have... Oh, we forgot to build another fishing boat. Another fishing boat. There we go. Glorious. Stupendous, even. How did we get 84 food? I guess we, we scavenged something, right? Yeah, we scavenged seven... What is this? Show me? No, it won't show me. Boot cans. Yeah. So, we got some... Uh, we got 30 raw seaweed. So if we really wanted to, we might switch this to sushi, which needs one fish, one seaweed, and creates three pieces of food. So this is really the best value that you can get out of cooking right now. And you need to do that in the food truck. But since uh, we are planning on unlocking the fishing hut, you need to use raw seaweed to get fish in the fishing hut. And I would like to see how much you will actually get. So we'll keep that. I will keep that seaweed for now. So that later within our playthrough we can properly test uh, the fishing hut. Farbom, I'm actually dying. I think maybe I could squeeze another 20 years max. Well, guess what? We all are actually dying. It's a dark topic, but that's it. <laughs> Weird old man, I wouldn't call 20 years soon. <laughs> That's quite a bit of time. <laughs> you want fresh sashimi? Mmm. Well, you know, we went for all you can eat China as our anniversary lunch, <laughs> kinda. And uh, it was delicious, but we didn't order the sushi part. The normal all you can eat includes. Uh, the rice stuff, the meats, the chicken, uh, the the. I don't even know all the words. So all the stuff outside of sushi. <laughs> you need to pay extra to be able to get sushi in that all you can eat. But we didn't because we were stuffed anyway. <laughs> but one of these days I would actually like to go for some sushi again. It has been quite some time. Well, I'm expecting another year or so. <laughs> what are you expecting another year? Like 21 years or... Or just one more year? Come on. <laughs> you will definitely live for longer. Come on. And you know how it works. Um, you never know when something uh, bad can happen, so... Everybody tells you to live your life to the fullest, but on the other hand, can you? Can you always? We went for sushi for my birthday when my parents visited. Nice. Wait. Wait, I'll be right back, because Albus is, is jumping on something in the kitchen. I'm back. Sorry about that. I know what he was jumping for. There is a... There are chicken legs defrosting on the counter. 
and maybe he finally caught some sense of them because they defrosted enough to maybe have some kind of some kind of a uh, an odor <laughs> some kind of smell but i gave him his little meaty treat so i also gave him a few treats during my lunch break so he should be fine he's just curious and he would eat anything not really he's very picky <laughs> And what did I miss? Uh, so, Firebomb, I'm disabled and have chronic health problems, so it's just life. Yeah. Yeah, I know, I know. We have talked.